Hello everyone. Welcome back to cloud computing classes. So today we will discuss about to open Nebula software. So open Nebula software is a cloud computing software or tool which is manages and control the all activity of user on cloud computing platform. So first of all, I tell you what is Open Nebula software. So Open Nebula is an open source management tool that helps virtualize data center, oversee private cloud, public cloud, and hybrid cloud. So Open Nebula combines existing virtualization technologies with advanced feature for multi-tenancy, automated provisioning, and elasticity. So a built-in virtual network manager maps virtual network to physical network. So Open Nebula is a vendor neutral as well as platform and API related software. So it can KVM, Zen, or VMware hypervisor. So Open Nebula is a free and open source software solution for building cloud and for data center virtualization. Uh, it is based on open technologies and it is a distributed under the Apache license too. So Open Nebula has features for scalability, integration, security and accountability and it offers cloud users and administration a choice for interface. So here I discuss about the some point of benefit of Open Nebula software. So Open Nebula software, the ideal solution for heterogeneous computing center environment. So the main advantage of Open Nebula are uh, first is it is a hundred percent open source and offer all the features in one edition. And second is, it provides control via the command line interface or web interface that is known as a CLI interface, which is ideal for a variety of user group and needs. So next point is, uh, Open Nebula is available for all major Linux distribution, thus simplifying installation. So next point is, the long term use of open nebula in a large scale production environment has proven its stability and flexibility. So next and last point of benefit of open nebula software. So open nebula is interoperable and support open cloud computing interface and Amazon Web services. So next point is key features of Open Nebula. So Open Nebula has features for scalability, integration, security, and user and groups. So the developer has claimed that it support standardization, interoperability, and portability. So it allows cloud users and administrator to choose from several cloud interface so some cloud interface so first question is arise why open nebula so first point is web interface or cli the choice is your so second is availability at all time availability at all time means open nebula 
not only take care of initial provision but the high availability of its cloud environment is much better compared to other cloud solution so of course the central open novella services can be configured for high availability that is that is not absolutely necessary so all system continue to operate in their original condition and are automatically included in the restored availability of the control process and next features of the open nebula so easy re remote access so easy remote access means in virtual environment one lack the ability to direct access the system when there are operational problem or issue with the device here open nebula offer an easy solution using the browser one can access the system console of the host system with integrated server so next key features of the open novella that is a full control and monitoring so all host virtual machine and guest operating system yeah or guest system are constantly monitored in open novella which keep the host and virtual machine dashboard up to date at all times depending on the configuration so a virtual machine is to be restarted in case of the host system failing or if migrating to a different system if a data store is used with parallel access the system can of course be moved while in operation on to other hardware the maintenance window can be minimized and can often be completely avoided so next and last feature of open nebula is open standard so open standard means open nebula is 100% open source under the apache license by supporting open standard such as open cloud interface and a host of other open architecture so open nebula provide the security scalability and freedom of a reliable cloud solution without vendor lock in system which involve considerable support and follow up cost so next topic in open nebula that is a open nebula architecture so open nebula architecture to control a virtual machine life cycle the open nebula core coordinate with the following three area of management so first is image and storage technology second is the network fabric technology third is hypervisor so first is image and storage technology create to disk images and second is the network technology to provide the virtual network environment and third is hypervisor system so hypervisor is create and control all virtual machine in cloud so through the open nebula core can perform the evo operation it also support the deployment of services so virtual machines this are uh, take a decision by a separate scheduler component so it follows the rank scheduling policy which makes place for virtual machine on a physical host according to the rank given by the scheduler so these ranks are decided by the scheduler using a rank algorithm so open nebula uses cloud driver to interact with external cloud and also integrate the core with other management tool by using management interface so here uh, next point of open nebula that is a component of open nebula so based on the existing infrastructure that is a infrastructure as a services that open nebula provides various services and resources so uh, you can see you can see in the figure so first is api and interface api means application programming 
and interface means wave interface or command line interface so first point is api and interface so second component of users and group third component of host and vm resources and fourth component of open nebula that is a storage component and next component of open nebula is network component so i discuss about two first component so api and interface so api and interface means these are used to manage and monitor open nebula component to manage physical and virtual resources they work as an interfaces so second is user and group so user and group means these support authentication and are authorized individual user and groups with the individual permissions so third is host and virtual machine resources so these are a key aspect of a heterogeneous cloud that is managed and monitored that is known as a zen hypervisor or vmware software so fourth is storage component so these are the basic for centralized or decentralized template repositories so next is network components so network components these can be managed flexibly naturally there is the support for vlan and open v6 network so here i discuss about the some other points in uh, open novella software so first point is the front end second point is virtualization host third point is storage system so first is the front end machine the the front end means the machine that has open nebula installed on it known as the front end machine which is also responsible for executing open nebula services so the front end needs to have access to the image repository and network connectivity to each node so open nebula services are first is management and scheduler second is monitoring and accounting third is wave interface server fourth is cloud api server and next point is virtualization host so virtualization host means to run the virtual machine we require some physical machine which are called host machine so i repeat to run the virtual machine we require some physical machine which are called host machine so the virtualization sub system is responsible for communicating with the hypervisor and taking the required action for any node in the virtual machine life cycle third is during the installation the admin account should be enabled to execute command with root privileges and third point is storage so data store are used to handle the virtual machine images and each data store must be accessible by the front end using any type of storage technology so open nebula has three type of data store first is file data store second is image data store third is file system so first is file data store so file data store used to store the plain files not a disk image files second is image data store image data store means repository for images only system data store used to hold the running virtual machine images so the image data store type depend on the storage technology used there are three type of image data store available
to monitor and manage hypervisor and to move virtual machine images. And next is XLAN protocol. So next topic is internal architecture of Open Nebula. So basic component of Open Nebula is first is host, host, second is cluster, third is template, fourth is image, fifth is virtual machine, sixth is virtual network. So first is host, host machine, what is host machine? So host machine means physical machine running is supported hypervisor. So second is cluster. So cluster is a pool of host that save data, store and virtual network. Third is template. So template means all virtual machine definition in available available a single platform. So images, virtual machine disk image and virtual machine. So virtual machine instantiate template, a virtual machine represent one life cycle and several or other computing system. And next is virtual network. So a group of IP leases that virtual machine can use to automatically obtain IP address. It allows the certain of virtual network by mapping over the physical ones. So they will be available to the virtual machine through the corresponding bridges on host. Virtual network can be defined in three different parts. So first is underlying of physical network infrastructure. Second is the logical address space available. Third is context attributes. So that is a open novella software.